What AMD promised and what AMD delivered were two different things. Now, under the hood of the Q6600, we see that Intel is back to its old tricks of multiple dies, just like the Pen EMD. However, this time, it kind of works. The Phenom, however, is a true quad core with independent L2 cache, and it also has shared L3 cache. And each time for Cinebench, the Core 2 quad pulled ahead, but only slightly. In heaven, the Phenom pulled ahead very slightly with a slightly higher score. So both performed about the same. Now with superposition, I found this interesting. The load times for the Core 2 Quad were terrible. I ran this multiple times, rebooted, and even troubleshooted to make sure there wasn't some background process that was causing problems. But no, the Core 2 Quad took nearly 30 seconds longer just to load the benchmark. This was using the same RAM, drive, and Windows image. In GTA 4, the frame rate seemed about the same at first, but the one thing I immediately noticed was how the game felt on the Phenom. There was no contest. The Core 2 Quad felt forced, like it was struggling to keep up and it really wasn't interested. The Phenom was super fluid, near instant control response, no lag. This just felt better. 